voters will decide who will be the next mayor of Wichita Falls. Be sure to tune in for our live mayoral debate on News Channel 6 on Tuesday, October 17th at 6 p.m. Bible tells us in James 5, 13, Is anyone among you suffering? Let him pray. Is anyone cheerful? Let him sing psalms. We value gospel singing in and out of the assembly. Consider its rich significance. Hebrews 13, 15, Therefore by him... Let us continually offer the sacrifice of praise to God, that is, the fruit of our lips, giving thanks to his name. Watch Let the Bible Speak Saturday nights at 1030 for a straightforward message from God's Word and two beautiful a cappella songs. From Sony Picture Studios, it's America's Day. Stars of our show, at St. Jack and Vanna White. Hey there! Hey, there must be an applause sign on there. Thank you, Jeff. Thanks, everybody. Time to party. Well, hello! What are y'all doing here? Get ready. If you want to win some money, $1,000 at stake in our first toss-up. The category is Thing. Uh, Vanna, if you please. American icon. That's it. You got it. I don't like to start the show by being testy. I've told you before, I don't like puzzles that refer so directly to me. Okay? <laughs> Hello, Ronnie. Hi. Uh, Ronnie Lathrop is here from Prairie Village, Kansas. Yes. And I want to hear the Ronnie Lathrop story. Let's go. The Ronnie Lathrop story. Yes. I'm a retired English teacher from yeah. Kansas City area, and um, now I work for a nonprofit helping people um, train others in uh, reducing HIV. Okay. Are you involved in the paranormal or have been, or what's the... I, you know, I was about 15 years ago. I was a part of a team as a skeptic because I just don't believe in ghosts. I think they're kind of weird. And um, yeah. somebody that haunts a place and wears a Victorian outfit, it just doesn't make sense to me very much. <laughs> if I were a ghost, I'd be the nude ghost, I think. <laughs> Scaring people in more than one way. You know, I'm just really sorry I got into all this. <laughs> I won't haunt you, Pat, I promise. On the other hand, I wish you luck on the show. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Hi, Rhea. Hi, Pat. Uh, Rhea Matthew, uh, Redwood City, California, registered nurse there, huh? Yes. And uh, a traveler. I like to get in as much traveling as possible on my days off. In the last year, I visited six different countries, and we're still counting. Wow. So what's the most exciting place you've been to? Uh, I think it's got to be Iceland. Oh, that sounds pretty cool. Uh, you want to talk about your parents? Go ahead. Yes, um, we are longtime wheel watchers. My parents first started watching the show when they immigrated from India over 30 years ago, and it helped them practice their English. Yeah, and so... we've heard that before, and that always makes us feel good. That's yeah. Right. We'll give them our best. And of course. Nice to have you. <laughs> You're a good daughter. <laughs> Hi, Betsy. Hello, Pat. Uh, Betsy Edwards, Roseville, California. I'm going to start with this because to look at you, I would not say that you swear a lot. <laughs> but... Do, do, do unpleasant words come through? Pat, it's amazing the flurry of profanity that sometimes comes flying out of my mouth. But I will do my best to be on my good behavior today. Thank you very much. Uh, <laughs> we appreciate that. Let's talk about your family. I've been married to my handsome and hilarious husband, Terry, for 40 years. Almost as long as Wheel's been on the air. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, one son? One wonderful son, Jason, and he has lovely wife, Lisa, and we have two amazing adult grandchildren, Nicole and Mark. All right, well, it's good to have you all here. Everybody you. watch your language, and uh, let's do our <laughs> second toss-up. Get ready for it. It's worth $2,000. The category is person. Here we go. Betsy gets two thousand dollars. She'll be spinning very shortly. Tonight we have something special for our contestants. Not only is there a great trip on the wheel, but someone can also win this fabulous prize. Here's Jeff. Right, Pat. Here's one of tonight's featured prizes. It's cash, courtesy of Laura Geller Beauty. Everyday glamour is possible with Laura Geller's limited edition Wheel of Fortune makeup collection. Available online now at laurageller.com. Seven thousand five hundred dollars. Nothing wrong with cash, huh?
A uh, phrase is the category for this first round, and uh, we'll take a look at the puzzle, and then we'll put Betsy to work. All right. And it's 600. T. Uh, there are two of them. Um, I'd like to buy a vowel. Sure. The E. She said confidently, and she should be confident. There are eight of them out there. Oh, wait. Vanna's going to be touching for a while here, and while she does that, I will tell you you have nine hundred fifty dollars left. Oh, ah, oh. Oh. <laughs> heaven's sake! <laughs> wow, this is going to be it's going to be, be one of those housewife shows with Rats. nothing but bleeps the whole show. <laughs> uh, Ronnie, go ahead. Eight fifty. L. Uh, three L's, yeah. And oh, I can't get any traction here. These bankrupts are killing us. Rhea. Nine hundred. S. Do we have an S up there? We have three of them, and you have twenty-seven hundred dollars. Can I buy a vowel, Pat? Mm-hmm. A? There are four A's. <laughs> 600. M. Yeah, give her a couple of M's. I'll buy a vowel. I? There is no I. I'm sorry. And, Betsy, it's your turn. Can I solve the puzzle? Okay. With no money? Is that okay? You can. Okay. We'll give you, you know, there's a thousand dollar minimum. So okay. Let's make sure we're all on the same page. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Yeah. The money's overrated anyway. <laughs> so, so we will give you a thousand dollars, which takes up to three thousand, which means you have the early lead, and uh, we have an early commercial. We'll be back with more wheel after this. Stay tuned. We've got lots more game to play and lots more money to give away.